Well, how do there, people? I am back in Death in the Water 2. I think this is dive number six. Yeah. Okay, I wonder if it's going to have what, one chest or two chests. I'm just going to turn down the volume from here, little, because that's a little loud in my ear. No introduction, lady, on this mission. Okay, so I'm just going to be heading over to where this marker is. And funny enough, there's no cracking in this mission either. It just seems very despondent from the rest of it. But uh, trust me, this mission is easily the hardest one that I've come across so far. And the actual new weapon that I've got, that's a manta ray. It's not all that powerful. <laughs> I'll probably get it out during this episode and show you what I mean, people. As if I don't die. Um, this mission is extremely hard. Okay, so we're going to pop this up. Now, there's two boss sharks in this mission. There's a mako shark. And there's quite a few of the nurse type looking sharks. There's a lot of these freaking snakes as well, which are a pain in the blinking neck. So we'll get rid of him. Look at those lovely yellow fishes there, aren't they cool? Right, take out that guy as well. There's one more snake over here, there's three of them. Now once you reach this oxygen pack in here, peeps. Oh no, I shot the dead one again. Alright, reload. Well, they've upgraded this spear gun, and it's supposed to reload quicker, and it's got three spears around the side. It doesn't seem to have done much. I mean, in the pictures, when I'm upgrading, it looks like it's done loads, but no. There you go, there's a chest here, people, just above the actual oxygen pack. We'll be coming back to this oxygen pack in a moment, but for now, we don't need it. So there's three chests, not four on this one. There was four on the previous mission. But, uh, yep, yeah, just three on this one. Got all of our lovely octopus coins. Right, let's go, let's go. Now, when you exit out of here, I mean, this this eel, he can be temperamental sometimes. Sometimes he bites you, sometimes he doesn't. I'm just going to leave him be. But you need to head over this way, I think. And there's a chest on the on the compass. You're following that one. It's over to the west of the way. So let's uh, go down here. Now, again, the sharks are not going to bother you too much, so there's no need to really start shooting at anything just yet. But by the time you reach this chest, you might hear that sort of... It goes a little bit crazy, and and that sometimes happens. Right, there we go. I mean, although I've been quite quick, this one, you've got to be super quick. See what I mean? So I've not managed to get all three chests before that happens. So uh, you're already you know, up against it because we're going to be taking on sharks while trying to get the last chest. Holy fudge. Okay, I need that. Definitely need that health pack. That's my new ammo there for the new weapon. Right, so now I'm going to be swimming back to that oxygen pack, I think. Um, wherever the marker is. There it is, over this way. And then after you pick this one up, it will give you a second oxygen marker, or should... And that takes you over to where you need to get to for your third chest. So, sadly, you're going to have to struggle a little bit taking on evil enemies that have been aggravated. So sometimes, you know, like that yellow eel, oh, it's not here. Okay, it seems to have done one, which is good. Because he can be a little bit temperamental. Right, and it's a good thing that I killed all those snakes before they went aggroed. Or else getting this oxygen pack isn't easy. Okay, so now let's run back out. And you can see there, there's one that's 60 odd meters away. Now you've just got to head towards that marker. While keeping an eye out for any sort of sharks that might come at you, because they will. Where is that marker? There it is over there. It's quite faded at the moment. This is going to take you over to a very familiar area. It's where all of the you know, sort of you know, the cargo containers were before. Just keep going, swim de swim. And it's quite hard to locate the actual container that it's in. But it's, it looks like the same container it was in when we did the you know, the, the cargo drop one. The one with, with the, the red cargo container that's got like a half open door. That's what you're looking for. There's lots of these packs here as well. If you do get here and you, you're not being followed by much, you might want to hatch these open anyway and look for a medical kit. Because trust me, it gets, it gets extremely, extremely terrifying um, a bit later on. Got him from a distance. Nice. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. See what I mean? We've got sharks coming in already. Let's just grab that. Out of it, mate. Okay. Head towards that 
oxygen pack, but um, that's not where the actual chest is. You should be able to see the chest on your compass. So let's head towards that chest. Let's see if we can get it. It's a red one. That it's not this one. Oh, it is this one. It's a blue one. Sorry, people. It's a blue one. But it's got the door half closed. Now, I normally spend a lot of my time inside of here just defending it. There's a lot of the sharks can swim inside of here, but they, they can't come in through the back. So there's only one way in and one way out. Let's get the chest quickly. Oh. Ah, come on. Open chest, open, 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 open. Stop pushing me up. Sweet. Okay, I think that's it from there. Okay, right. So, there's another oxygen pack over there, 20 meters over that way. But we're going to stay in here and defend this for a little while. Reload. Okay, that was a pretty good hit. I'm just going to go out and grab that. Swim back in. We didn't pop the yellow thing. That's a bit weird, isn't it? See if we can get that snake from here. Got him. He has popped a yellow thing, but I'm, I'm not overly sure I should risk getting it. So stay here, and eventually the Mako shark will turn up. And that's when things get really hard. Okay. Cool. Got a whole, whole litter of dead sharks around here now. Okay, right. Um, my auction's getting slightly low. I'm going to wait till it's a little bit lower. Any other sharks? There's one. I've injured a couple. That one's dead. See if we can just get this one here. Go, let's go get those two. Reload, reload, reload. Okay, cool. Right, now we'll go get the oxygen. And this is when the Mako shark is going to turn up. Now, I did say I'd show you the other weapon. You know what? I don't think I really overly need to. It, it's terrible. It doesn't do hardly any damage. Okay, that was a bit nasty. Okay. Well, I hate that when you pick up stuff. It takes a little while before you can actually shoot again. Now there's two ways in to this one, so you can get bit from behind. It can be a bit dangerous being in here. I'm just staying here for a little while just so I can get the extra arrows again. Then I'm gonna head on out. I could do with getting back into that container I was in before. Um, sometimes I swim over to the the old shipwreck, you know, the Odyssey. I can get all the way back over there. But Come on then. Just take your time on this one, people. I know that you get extra bonus points for how long it takes or whatever, but seriously, there is some hard, hard enemies out there. When the Mako shark turns up, you're going to be thankful you stayed in your container. There's the nurse shark. At least I think it's a nurse shark. Or need a nurse shark anyway. Tell you what, I'll show you that other weapon while I'm just in here. To show you just how shite it actually is. If I hit something. The damage effects it does is quite cool. But um yeah, didn't actually hit anything with it. I'm not that good with it. Maybe it'd be better. It's got like little mini explosions. Explosives, they put. Yeah, there we go. Got one. Come on then. 
large one. There's the Mako. Okay, right, I'm gonna swap back to that. Reloading. Look at him, freaking lethal. As long as you can keep hitting him, he should try to swim away rather than attack you. But um, that's not always true. Sometimes he tanks it and comes straight at you. Where's he gone? He takes a heck of a lot of killing. Like he's made out of freaking titanium or something. No shark. It's a, he's he's a tough one as well. Kill that one. Ooh wee! Is that the Mako? I think that's the Mako shark. Got really dead eyes. Different sort of looking tail fin as well. S far more streamlined than the other sharks. Faster as well. He's going to catch you as soon as you go out. That nurse shark is full of freaking arrows. There's one right over there. Okay, I know this is a bit of a cowardly way to play, but trust me, you don't want to go out there, not with the nurse shark and the Mako. Okay, I'm risking it. Popped my head out for a second. Where is he? I'm gonna have to go and get some oxygen in a moment. I'd rather not. Right, we've got the nurse shark's attention. We've got the nurse shark. The nurse shark's down. Right, now it's just me and the Mako. I think I'm gonna make a run for the oxygen again. Swim faster, that Mako is going to be right behind me. Oof. Okay, not right behind me. But I am proper bricking it now. Is that him? That's not him. I think he just went down there. But we might as well take out these little ones. Get some more multipliers. But it's basically the Mako that you need to take out to complete the, the mission. I think that's him there. Yeah, that's him. He's coming at me. Ooh. This, this level's a lot longer than any others. Uh-oh, I missed. In the mouth just as he went to get me. Come on. Look at him. Whoa. That was close. We got him. That's the level done. God, that's that. I still got a gold, uh, and we got quite a lot of points there. We got all three chests. What a nice looking trophy with the corals, but wow, that's unnerving. It's, it's getting harder now, it's getting a lot harder, and I don't think I should have gone for that. Um, I've got 3,000 that I can use, but how much is this? That's 5,000. This one? Um, 6,000. 
having my joypad plugged in, it's sort of, I don't know what it's doing, but it's glitching out a bit, but yeah. I can't afford any of those, so I could try and upgrade this. I've done the explosive damage to the top, so... Reload rate. Might as well. Might as well just go to town on the one that I've invested in. And... Oh, okay. I thought I upgraded that all the way. I've only got 150 gold left, so we're not going to be able to do much with that. There we go, people. It looks like there's 5 out of 10 on here as well, so I can still do a little bit more with my diver. Maybe I need to do that next time. There we are, people. I think that's pretty much where we're going to be leaving off today. Uh, let's just hit start on there, though. Okay. Hiya. Yep. Go on. There we are, people. That was dive six done, and <laughs> it's good fun. Yeah, liking this a lot, but it's it's adrenaline fueled pumping stuff, and you can see my level of concentration. It's a, it's a bit different than No Man's Sky. Let's face it. Anyway, until next time. Bye, goodbye, goodbye again. <laughs>